name is Susan and welcome back to Susan React to the channel where I react to music related stuff. So today we are watching another Eurovision song performance slash music video from this year's Eurovision song contest, of course. I done one on my home country Lithuania's performance, like the final song that we're sending to the Eurovision song contest, and I've done one on Israel, which seems to be the most popular song currently from all the ones that are participating. At least according to all the speculations and you know like fan favorites and stuff like that. However, another song that is speculated to do well is Estonia's entry. And this is by Elena Nyakayeva. I'm sorry if I mispronounced that. Feel free to correct me. And it's called La Forza, which I have no idea what that means, but I'm really curious and excited to listen to this. So without further ado, let's click play and let's see what the song's all about. Oh, it's called it, it's pronounced Nyakayeva. Okay. Oh, that's gloomy. It's filmed in a cool way though. Oh, I love the sparkles. I guess I'm going for a, like a serious take following last year's Portugal success. That's impressive. I love the production, like the arrangement and the performance on this. Her voice is impressive. I love the stage effects. Like this is really beautifully done. A very aesthetically pleasing performance. Oh my god, is that glitter on her hands? I approve. <laughs> I just love how creatively it's filmed. Like, a lot of performances are just like very, you know, like standard, just like filming the singers. And this is almost done in a cinematic way. I just can't help but think like. How is this the second most popular song from this year's contest? So far, you know, like what I've seen from all the charts and like top 10 Eurovision 2018 songs. Like, this is a very serious and very beautifully made song, but like in Eurovision of all places, how is this the second most popular song this year? I mean, I haven't heard any others, but you know, but of course, it's just like my personal opinion. This is a really beautiful song, objectively. Wow, is that all? Ooh, that went by fast. I gotta say, I fully expected this to get boring, but with the way that the performance was filmed, and of course with the flawless way that she performed the song, this went by really quickly, and it wasn't boring at all. Like, this was an entertaining performance. I'm just really just like curious, why this? Why are people so in love with this. Like, I genuinely appreciate the artistry in this. Her dress and all the staging, like, everything seems very polished and very beautiful here. I'm just wondering if that's all that people need to be impressed in Eurovision Song Contest, or is there something more to the song that I maybe didn't catch while listening, you know, to it for the first time, you know, like, as my first impression. Because, you know, like, having watched the Eurovision Song Contest for the past, like, what, of 10 years, usually these kinds of songs get overlooked unless there's something really extremely shocking about the performance. But this whole thing was just like really simple compared to some other things that we've seen on the Eurovision stage and even compared to Israel's song. Like I haven't seen Israel's performance, just the music video, but like even the song is something unique and something that's, you know, like will attract everybody's attention, you know, whether it be in a positive way or a negative way. This just seems like something that would slide through, but I hope it doesn't because it's genuinely a pretty song. The girl has an amazing voice and it seems like a genuinely professional and polished and great quality performance that truly belongs on something bigger than the Eurovision stage, you know? Like it feels a lot more prestigious, <laughs> you know? Like not that Eurovision Song Contest is not prestigious, it's just like more so fun and all over the place 
and this just seems so serious it almost seems out of place regardless i wish all the luck to Estonia. This was a really beautiful piece of music and the performance was done amazingly. What do you guys think about the song? Tell me in the comments down below, I'm really curious to know. And also tell me which other Eurovision songs I should react to because of course I won't be able to make reactions to all the songs but I'm definitely curious to listen to some more of the songs from this year's Eurovision. Because last year I waited till the actual contest to hear a lot of entries and I feel like I missed out on a lot of fun. So this year I decided to spoil some of the entries for myself and I've been having fun so far. So yeah, let me know which other songs I should react to in the comments down below and also if you enjoy my content and would like to support me beyond watching my videos feel free to check out my patreon page i will have a link in the description and in the pinned comment below the video also make sure you subscribe to this reaction channel because i post new reaction videos every single day and yeah thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you next time i love you guys bye